Hello everyone and welcome back for part three of this Dragon's Dogma Arisen. Dark Arisen playthrough. Go ahead and get my chat set up and we'll jump right into it for the Saturday afternoon stream. Okay, I think we're ready to begin. Yes, we are. Hey, Rick. First one in chat. Wow. Oh, Odessa might have beat you, Rick, over in the Twitch chat. All right, so tonight we push on. Last session was pretty crazy as we went and helped uh, retake that fortress from the goblins. And now I have returned to Sir Maximilian to turn in that quest. And he has a couple more quests for us to do before we gain favor with the Duke and we can actually speak to the Duke of Grand Soren. Good afternoon, Char. So yeah, let's uh, let's speak with him and pick up our next quest and that'll be the focus of today's stream. I'll probably do a few side quests while we're working on the main quest. And yeah, we'll go from there. How you doing, brother? It will be my honor to show you the ready charges for the worm hunt. The choice is yours. Okay, decipher a text, investigate a cult, or aid a research team. Let's aid a research team. Certainly. Then here are the details. By the Duke's decree, we spare no effort in gathering knowledge concerning the worm. As one arm of that pursuit, we aid the faith in their examination of ruins and relics. Music might be a bit loud. One such ruin has of late become home to monsters. We've received a request for escort. A request for escort. They've asked for you by name, sir. What response might I give them? Except. My thanks, sir. His grace has commanded the utmost attention be given to such matters. Pray speak to Father Geoffrey at the cathedral in the city for details of the task. Were the decision mine, I would set every man we have to defending our strongholds. But such is our duty. Hey, you gotta pay for the researchers, right? Get those government grants. Okay, cool. Keats. Zypras, hello. Dwight Chapin. And Jester, what's going on? Shy Violet? Oh my god. LSR? Holy crap. We have the OGs of the Wolf Pack stopping by for the Saturday afternoon stream. Absolutely incredible. Alright, Stefan asked you to locate Salama. Oh, that's a side quest right there. Protect a survey party investigating ruins that may offer new insights on the dragon. Meet Father Jeffrey at the Grand Soren Cathedral for information on this. So where's the cathedral? Oh, I was headed the right way. Yeah, we'll pick up that quest, then I have to go stop at some of the vendors. We'll rest to make it morning time, maybe pick up a few skills. I'm really kind of sad that the warrior only gets three attacks. Didn't expect that. I'm loving this class so much, too. Oh, you'll have to come again later. Okay. Well, in that case, let's go ahead and take a little resty poo right now. Go turn in some equipment. As you can see, my character's a little bit over-encumbered. I wonder how strict they're going to be with the encumbrance levels in DD2. Many of these are like to be homes of members of the Duke's court. It's kind of annoying, but I also kind of respect the encumbrance at the same time, and I think I prefer games to be a little bit more strict with that stuff. It adds a little bit more to the importance of inventory management and right. character. <coughs> excuse me, character weight makes it a little bit more realistic. Seems this, is this is kind of funny in RPGs, how you can just load up your inventory, like Baldur's Gate 3, with like 8,000 pounds of equipment, and it doesn't do anything to the character. The life of a it does do something in Baldur's Gate trials. 3, but you can put a lot before it's you start feeling encumbered. Alright, let's stop at the inn real fast. Is DD1 good? I'm having a blast, Keats. I'm loving it so much. This is my second time playing, and I'm Royal enjoying it more than my first time. No, so I feel you have your pick. All right, Any let's um, like, what will it see how many today? discipline points that I have right now. 10,000 discipline points? Oh my god. 
Oh, this is going to be a fun session. Okay, so long sword. We have whirlwind slash, an advanced form of upward strike. Stabs and slashes upwards with greater force. Sending foes even higher into the air. They already went way above my screen. All right. An advanced form of pommel strike drives the blade's hilt into the target. The limited in range is capable of causing even powerful enemies to reel. Okay. Basic upgrade. And then Savage Lunge. Charge forward with a blade held across the body, knocking down any caught in its path. Oh, that's nice. Get a little bit of a charge with it. And then for core skills, we have Devastate. Extends a chain of one-handed sword slash across a broader range. Um, eviscerate withdraws the blade with a sweep after stabbing the target. Okay, so these are core skills. Then we haven't bought Controlled Fall. Tucks the body into a tight roll when falling. Sure. All right, and then augments ferocity increases the lethality of your core skills. Sign me up. Well, the warrior is pretty simple because you just don't really get that much to choose from. But all right, let's go to Tardis now, and I have to reorganize Tardis's skills here. Um, high Brontide, an advanced form of Brontide that calls forth a longer-lasting whip of lightning that drops more bolts when dismissed. Sends forth Tendrils of Dark Energy. We're going to hold off on that for now. Oh, yeah, we need the better heal. Oh, that's great. Haladom is the one that gets... Oh, damn it. Okay, I do have Haladom. I don't have High Haladom. I wish I bought that. Intervention. Reduces cumulative damage. Okay, we don't need that right now. All right, so for Tardis, let's go ahead and let's pick up... We have High Anodyne. Let's get rid of the Thunder Affinity, and let's pick up Haladom. Although that doesn't seem to actually help with um, blindness. I wonder if it's the high Heladon that helps with blindness. I'm going to leave my, my offensive spells on the primary. My defensive support spells on the secondary. So we have the heal, we have the poison, holy affinity, and fire affinity. Hmm, decisions to make here. Lots of decisions to make. That's probably fine. Why not? What will it be today? All right, and then for Wolf, we already have the upgrades. I think they automatically take place. And augments. Let's add ferocity. Beautiful. What will it be today? Have your pick. Any? What will it be today? Deposit a few of my materials here. Wonder if I should just sell some of these. Don't really need. I'll store some of these. Curious wine. I'm going to come back to this stuff off stream sometime and try to figure out the crafting and stuff like that and just take my time. What is that? Scale coat. Probably sell that stuff. All right. Curatives. I oh, so this is a dropper that restores sight to the eyes. This is what I could have used yesterday. Nice, I have a lot of these. I wonder how you do an improved green warish. There's probably a certain combination that does that quite easily. What will it be today? Hey, what does TARDIS have on his character? Why do we have rocks in here? Oh, gold ore. Let's deposit that. Yeah, all of our crafting materials is going right into our depository. What will it be today? And then equipment. Let's see what we got here. What did I pick up? Nope, that's not that good. I think the set that I have right now is really good. <laughs> My character, that's funny. I really like that, though. But unfortunately, the armor that I'm wearing what is will a full it be set. Today? Have your pick. Any you like. What will it be today? Understood. Hey, Ray. Thought we were waiting until Sunday. Uh, I don't believe I said that. I think last stream I said that I might stream today. If I do stream tomorrow, it's going to be in the evening time because I have poker in the afternoon, so. Red Cape, hello. All right, Shy, sounds good. Pick up our pawns, Wolf. They don't cost Rift Crystals because you're taking friends' pawns. Shy's at level 63. Ooh, my question is, though, if I pick up Shy's pawn, is that going to trivialize the game for me? Like, shouldn't I pick up pawns that are a little bit closer to my level? Like, how does that work? 
We're gonna head. We're gonna change out my pawns right now, though. So maybe if I pick up Shy's pawn, then I'll just get rid of. Uh, maybe only run with two pawns instead of three. <laughs> no surprise, given the fact you came to the cap. I fear great expectation. You seem to so have your pick. Any you like. Okay, let's head out. Come let's go to soon. the pawn guild. Should probably run around town a little bit. Let me see if there's anything going on around here. The unfortunate thing about this game is that the city is so ugly. It's so grand, but it's so ugly at the same time. We have a barber shop. That's great. Welcome. The Arisen, is it? Devon, if it please you. I was a doctor before taking up a barber shears. With the dragon come, I'd like to do better business playing sawbones again. What will it be today, hmm? <laughs> this is great. We can give TARDIS a haircut, but he doesn't have any hair. <laughs> can you play as Magic Archer? You can play as Magic Archer. Are you asking me to change my vocation for you right now? I'm sure I'll be a Magic Archer at some time, but not ready for it just yet. As expected of a residential area. Much yeah, this quiet. is one ugly ass city, man. Hopefully DD2 is much more beautiful and it doesn't look like Kirkwall from Dragon Age 2. Oh, I love how you can get on the roof in this game though. It's super cool. I feel familiar with it this will. Now. Okay, well maybe if I pick up some pawns that are um maybe I'll pick up like uh Shy's pawns. If you guys have pawns that are way higher level than me, maybe I'll pick them up and do like some side quests, and then when I return to the main quest, I'll go back to a pawn that's closer to my level. I love the freedom that you have in this game, though, to just run the rooftops. Capcom really knows, like, little mechanics that you can add to the game that just add so much to the immersion of a game. Like, when you're on the city streets, just knowing that you can get on the roofs is already another level of immersion. Knowing that there's no, like, boundary to stop you from doing things, I think is super cool. Here's the mage, Rick. All right, let's go to the pawn guild. I wonder if I can get there from the rooftops. Let's go to the pawn guild. I am online right now, so if you guys want to hire TARDIS to your team, he should be available. Um, I actually don't know where I'm at right now. I have no idea. Is that the co Oh, that's the courtyard right there. Oh, cool. Assassin's Creed. Poker, you play for fun? Oh yeah, we play for fun. I mean, we all put in $20. 20 or $10 is the minimum buy-in, and you can buy back in for another 10 so $20 max. The winner walks away with like $80 to $100. Usually second place gets $10 back. So yeah, it's absolutely for fun, but we also add the money in, so there is a little bit of competition and a motivation to try to make good plays. Pawn Guild stands ahead. Tis a gathering place for my kind. You know what's it's nice is having this blue cape right now. Open. It's like a nice contrast to look at my character in comparison to the city walls. In the brick and the dull grass. A stone to recall the dead to living. Stones red as blood. And sore strain it. So this is the Pawn Guild. Okay, let's you go into the rift. As necessity demands here at the to build TARDIS up, picking up vitality as a fighter, maybe. Okay, let's see what this is all about. Um, we need to dismiss, but let's go into the pawn. I've never done this before. How do I find friends' pawns? Search. Oh, it's quite simple. Um, oh, this is so cool. <laughs> Look at this. So here's Rick's pawn, who's in the YouTube chat right now. Enzaville's pawn. Oh my god, you guys are crazy high ranks. Uh, Luality's pawn, who came into the chat last night and wanted uh, wanted us to run with her pawn for a little bit. I think Luality's pawn's around my level. Laura Croft is wonderful. Shy Violet! <laughs> oh, this is great. This is so cool. Unfortunately, some of the usernames I don't recommend, or I don't, not not recommend, I don't recognize because you guys use like seven different names. Uh, Adoram is, is a mod of the channel. 
All right, let's um, let's call in, let's call in Shy's pawn. Even though I don't think she's here. Oh, she is here at the moment. Let's see what Shy's pawn's looking like. Shouldn't we? Okay. Um, did I summon? Whoa! How do I unsummon? Oh, do they come out into the rift? Hey, oh, it's Rick! Oh, I just saw Rick a second. There's Rick right there! Look at Rick! Oh my god! Rick, what's going on, man? It's great to meet you, IRL, finally! What are you doing with your arm? For cripe's sake, Rick. You gonna be another TARDIS? Alright, let me, um, let's, uh, let's hire... This is Shy's pa- Oh my god, Shy! Is that you right there, Shy? You're like a foot taller than me. <laughs> yes, Arisen. All right, enlist. You cannot take on any more followers without releasing one Sorry, of your Ralph, you're going to have to go, brother. I am honored to travel with you. All right, we're going to take we're going to cross again. We're going to pick up Rick's pawn too cuz Rick and Shy are both here right now, so we're going to dismiss I'm going to have to run with two mages. I'm fine with that right now. It'll be interesting, actually. I wonder what ability... Let's take a look at Rick's yes, pawn reason. here. It's so cool because I didn't do this um, on my first run at all. I didn't even go online. All right, Rick. Let's see, let's see what Rick's rocking with here. What do you got, Rick? What can you bring to the party? High anodyne. Okay, so we got double heals. High spell screen. Invokes a magical sigil around the user that enhances the resistances and defenses of allies who enter... Oh, baby. Combustion invokes an even longer wall of flame. Aladam, very nice. You know what I could do? We can hire Rick's pawn, and then we can get we can change Tardis's abilities up at the end really fast. All right, Rick's got fire, holy, and high. Oh, nice. This is a hell of a mage right here. Okay. Yes, Arisen. You know what, Rick? I'll take you on. Okay, I'll take you up on your offer. Don't talk as much as Tardis talks. You cannot Fresh take sake. on any more followers. Without releasing one of your current companions. Cyan, it's time to go. I am honored to travel with you. Tardis, hello. Tardis, you are now accompanied by Rick C and Shy Violet. May our paths cross again. You better be on your A game today, Tardis, because I could be fixing to switch out my main pawn, even though the game doesn't allow it. I might have to download a mod. If Rick or Shy really excels here, you might be gone. Especially Rick, because he's a mage. All right, Chai, I'm trying to get to the Rift Stone. Okay, we're not off. We're not off to a good start here, Chai. What are you blocking off? Okay, there we go. This is a place quite restful to my Is it possible to add you as a friend on Steam? Um, no, yeah, no, you can add me. I, um, my name is Wolfhard FPS. Do you need any more information than that? Yeah, feel free to send a friend request. Okay, you can um, summon pawns as necessity demands. Wow, this is crazy. Yeah, let's go back to the inn real fast. And then we're going to head out on the research. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to do the main quest with Rick and Shy. I'm kind of curious to see, like, having two pawns that are double, triple my power, like, what that's actually going to do to the game. It'll be fun doing the mission regardless. And then we could just switch pawns out later if we want more of a challenge, which I'm sure that I'll do. All right, let's go this way. Head to the inn. God, this, this, the, all the mechanics in this game are so nuanced. So let's go set skills. And we're going to go set skills for TARDIS. And we're going to get rid of I Anodyne. We'll place it with, sure, we'll put Ice Affinity. We're going to get rid of Halidom. Actually, might, maybe it's not a bad idea to have two heals. That could actually come in hand. You know what? I think I'm kind of curious. Let's do double heals. Then let's do... Ice crap. What it Rick, do you have holy affinity? Tardis got high angle, high leaven. Um I feel like Rick didn't have fire affinity on or holy. I could be wrong with saying that. What will it be today? Like to have dealings have your pick. Yeah, come some again soon. Come. Jeez, Shy, you're quite intimidating. Let's prepare well. I'm making me insecure about myself. But it deals in vocations and skills besides. Grants or in both an impressive array of shops, truly. Your heal lasts even if you leave the effect. 
He has holy. Oh, okay, hold on. Let's get rid of Tardis' holy then real fast. Hold on. No For those of you guys that are wondering what's going on right now, I hired I two pawns from Rick and Shy. We're in the chats right now, and they're going to run with my character for this next quest. What will it be today? I'm trying to switch out skills, because Tardis is my main pawn. And, uh... What will it be today? We don't want to run necessarily double skills for everything. So let's change Holy Affinity, and let's put that to... We already have Ice Affinity. I Brontide. I don't think Rick had that. That's good enough. Okay. What will it be today? Have your pick. Any you like? Come again soon. All right, let's head on out. Come on, Rick. Come on, Shy. Tardis, get your ass over here. Uh, Rick and Shy. Once in a while, it's not a bad idea just to pick Tardis up, sling him on your shoulder, and then you know, continue on with the quest. Sometimes it saves a little bit of time. There's no end of requests to seek out new knowledge of the dragon these days. I don't see how some old scrawlings will thwart a beast what can't be held by stone walls. Might be that's why. They've no recourse but to hold out hope for some old magic ward. Are they actively playing with you? No, it's not a multiplayer game. These are just the pawns that they created in their own games. So, like, for example, like, you can... You know what I was thinking? For Dragon's Dogma 2... My main character is going to be my Beastrin, and I'm going to RP that character, but my main pawn, I might actually make Wolfheart. Like, customize the character to look like me and play the class that I typically play in games. So that way, when you guys hire my pawn, you're hiring me and not just, like, a randomly created character. Maybe when you guys do this, I can hire your main pawn, and it's actually you as opposed to some character that you just created to tag along the side of your main character. I think I'll do that on my first Dragon's Dogma 2 run. Um, I thought that might be a cool idea. So, yeah, so all these characters are the main pawns for Shy and Rick. This is, like, the main companion that they made in their game. All right. Let's, um... I'm trying to think. I, mean, I know I have a couple side quests right now, but... Oh, yeah, we have that one. You know what? Let's start off with this one. A gang of bandits has tightened its grip on the Southlands. Appease them or risk perilous travel. So we're going to help out one gang of bandits to earn their favor over another gang of bandits. I'm going to start off with that quest. This place is quite far away, so what I'm going to do is we're going to use my fairy stone. And we're going to teleport all the way out to... Yeah. I think that's... Wait. Where is this location? Interesting. I actually don't know how to get to this. I don't know if you go to the north or if I can reach there. It actually looks like I have to go to the north. Instead of my port crystal right here, because this is the fort, and it doesn't look like I can get out of the fort from the north or the east. So you know what? I think we have to... Wow, this is interesting. So we're going to do work for this gang of bands right here that's in this castle. But their rival gang is all the way up here to the north. So, let's just go out the front gates. Let's go on a little side adventure. Hey, Carly. You humans certainly do make a lot of expressions. I saw the previews for DD2 and it looks sick. With this on sale, I was going to try it out. Yeah, go for it, man. I think it's like on sale for like $6, isn't it? Oh, shit. join them. Oh, we have a griffin. This is the griffin part. On my way. Always send the pawns first to make sure it's safe. Oh, it's goblins. Okay. Burn them to ash! 
Karis, what are you doing? Tardis, what are you looking? Tardis is standing over here looking at the tree. What the hell's going on? It's fire. An imposing structure of fire. fire! Lend thy kiss! Is it coming back? I have played this game before, yes. Okay, I think we're good. Alright, let's get out of here. Move out. Alright, so I think we gotta go... I think I actually have to go this way. Yeah, so we gotta go... We gotta go upwards this way. I think we're gonna come across a couple of bandit groups. Let me try out my new attacks, though. My upgraded attacks. Let's see what they look like. Oh, wow. Okay, it looks a little different. And we have Pommel Bash, which looks exactly the same in Savage Lash. A good start to any task is talking with others. Let's begin with that. All right, let's head out, Pawns. Shit, what's my inventory weight? I'm an average right now. I let TARDIS hold everything. Urge the body of poisons. Let's give this charm to Rick. Dragon spit. Gotta start throwing this stuff, man. Oh, you know what I wish I did? I wish I bought some empty flasks so we could go to that healing well and pick up some of that water. Damn, it's really hard. The inventory management in this game is just tough, man. Alright, let's give TARDIS these ones. Skeleton key. A special key that can unlock any cell door, including those in dungeons or beneath Sorin. Okay, we're holding on to that. I think the reason why... Oh, crap. I forgot to sell. Um, Let's run back into the city real fast. The couple armor pieces that are weighing me down. Let's make a quick stop at the shop and head on out. Hello, Enigmatic. Oh, I didn't save the settings? Oh, okay. Thanks for letting me know. True. Fate, hello. Fate, do you have a character in this game? I thought I saw somebody named Fate. In the rift. Inventory magic can be a drag in this game. Yeah, it's almost too much of a drag. Like I said, I prefer games that have more hardcore mechanics where you actually do have to manage inventory. Like it's important, but this game seems a little bit little bit too hardcore this to where it's almost unenjoyable impact. and when something becomes unenjoyable uh, for the sake of immersion it's not always worth it oh we gotta talk to that guy too so yeah hopefully dd2 is a little bit more lenient with the weight but i hope it still matters at the same time all right let's sell yeah we gotta sell that oh yeah that weighs a shit ton nice the game also doesn't explain a lot of mechanics that well so like Players who are playing their first time that might not catch on just play the entire game like drag down and they think that's just the game, but in reality they're just missing a certain mechanic. The master works all, you oh yeah, we should probably enhance. Oh yes, let's go, baby. Good thing we came back. Also enhance my armor to level two. 
and we will enhance Tardis's armor. Can't enhance Tardis's armor. What about Tardis's staff? Nope. Tardis, how did you get two star gear wrong. quicker than my character did? What the hell is going on here? Come again. Hey T Dub, what's up? Weight classes matter a lot. Being on the heavy or very heavy sucks. Yeah, it does. This is gonna be a YouTube VOD? Yes. This entire Dragon's Dogma 1 series is can be viewed after the stream is over um, under the live tab on my channel's homepage. I also put all these in a playlist. We don't deal in the like of grimoires here. We're in honest business. Those magic tomes are oft forgeries, else stolen property. We're looking for a magic stone to resurrect this kid right now. It's a side quest. Oi, there's a notion. Why not ask a thief? They're more like to have it than honest folk like me, I'll warrant you. Take all the time you like. Okay, so she doesn't Take have the stone the that we're looking for. Um, so we'll just keep an eye out for... Oh, explore the thieves' den. I wonder if I should just do that right now while we're here. Uh, just to catch you guys up, the quest that I'm doing right now is... Nope, not that one. Um, wait, is it? Now I'm getting confused. Am I... Oh, it is. Shit, this is a different quest than the resurrection of the kid. Stefan asked you to locate Salomar's Grimoire, a tome empowered with arcane magics. It seems like the book yet remains somewhere in Granzis. The Grimoire is stored somewhere in the Bandit's hideout. Search the area and claim the throne. But well, where's the Bandit's hideout? I think that's actually where I have to go for the quest that we were initially working on. There's no end of request. I don't... My... This might line up perfectly actually. That narrows our search. Let's make for the south. Wow, Rick dropping some knowledge. Let's see what Shy can bring to the table here. That narrows our search. Let's make for the south. My god, Shy. Your voice is deeper than mine. Your character is bigger, more stronger, more handsome. I have to dismiss Shy's pawn. I was feeling really good with Tardis at my side. That was you, Fate? Okay, cool. We we'll we'll hire your, your pawn in here uh, on the next mission, Fate. Yeah, so it's really cool because Rick and Shy's pawn have already done this mission, so they have like more knowledge on where I'm going. Take a look at the map. Alright, so area map. What is this? Is this the thieves? Hold on. Okay. And then we have that thieves quest. Alright, you know what? Let's go here first. God, it's so easy to get sidetracked in this game. Like, we're, we're setting off on that one quest, and now I'm doing an entirely different quest. But that's okay. I wish it was easier to stop sprinting in this game. When you're using controller, like, letting go of... When you click it back in, your left joystick, it doesn't stop the sprint. Like, you have to actually let go. Hey, Gregory. I'm having fun. Yes, I'm having a lot of fun. Trying to watch Rick and Shy do some work here. We'll route them in a single charge. Take my fire! Good shit, Keep Rick. Tardis, are you learning from this advanced mage? Or what? I just... It's just such a good game. Like... The fact that I slung the goblin up and the other one was jumping at my character and it registered that that goblin hit my sword on the upswing and shot them both up into the air. That's just incredible game design. We have triumphed. What else would you expect with my help? This road is frequented by peddlers. The canyon... All right, sounds good, Ramco. Uh, what's your name on Steam? Is it Ramco? Damn it. Damn goblins.
still not in the light range. What else can I get? Hold on. What else can I... Why is this shit so heavy? We're in the light. I'm going to be able to move a little bit faster. We're going to give Shy that. We're going to give Shy all of our explosives. I trust Shy with explosives. There we go. Well, it's, it's not that much better, but... Floor. We'll need to What's up, stay wary. Good to see you again. Rip says I did Mystic Knight for most of the game, but switched to Warrior for post-game. I also like in this game how there's... It doesn't seem like there's level scaling. Oh, you're freaking done, brother. So as I come back through these areas that we've already visited, um, I can feel that power increase. I really like that, better than level scaling. Did you guys know Oblivion had level scaling in it? Well, I think Skyrim does too, actually. Definitely easier to design a game around level scaling, but I personally like games that don't have it. If you can create like a really good open world that encourages the player to you know, go certain places, etc. <sighs> Enzoville, what's up, man? I saw your pawn in the rift earlier today. We're gonna let Rick take these, or Shy take these harpies down. We have triumphed. Damn, Rick and Shire are just one shot in these harpies. Good shit. Tried to get Enzoville's palm, but it says his file is corrupted. Oh, damn. Enzoville. What the heck? Are you a hacker, Enzoville? Quite the grand structure. A way castle, perhaps. Follow this road north and we'll hit Grand Soren. The stone makes a regrettably effective wall. The sea is closer than I'd imagined. The road splits here. Let's be doubly sure of which will see us to our destination. I pray the day monsters no longer haunt the roads is not far off. Yeah, it's so cool, Hi. I think you do actually move a little bit slower with your weapon drawn. Kill them all! A large tree. Strength in numbers. Now we'll gain the upper hand. Wait for an opening. Help me! No! Ah! Stop! Stop! After they strike. They're left exposed after a grand strike. They attack in quick succession. Oh wait, is that a pawn? Just oh, wait. shit. We'll see a weakness. <laughs> My bad. I do that every time. <laughs> let's watch, um... Let's watch Shy and Rick do some work here in Tardis. They're left exposed after a grand strike. Next encounter, we're gonna watch them and see what they're capable of. Oh, I'm at the Thieves' Den, actually. They're armed, Master. Wait. Okay. Leave it to me. The Grimoire is stored somewhere in the bandit's hideout. Search the area and claim the tome. Am I not in that area right now? That's where the quest marker was, so... Um, let's search this area. See what we got here. Wait for an opening. 
Looks like Shy is killing some people down there. Counter after they strike. Oh my god, Shy, that's amazing. This is pawn tryouts right now. This my official states. party comp. Guy <laughs> pulling out the daggers. Wow! They attack wow. in succession. We have triumphed. That's incredible. Angel's pair. Genuinely confused for this quest right now. Um, oh, maybe in the abandoned storehouse. Let's check that. Maybe that's the thieves' hideout. Guys, good shit. Keep oh, moving. We are left exposed after well, I like that ice strike. enchantment. That was a hell of a shot, shot. Eh? If I may say so myself. The structure is abandoned. Let's have a look for supplies with you. I'll heal your wounds. Never forget. Constant vigilance. I have no idea. We could scale this slope, provided we sort out the shallowest slopes. No idea where this thieves hideout is, or if I'm even doing this quest right. Tree. Try to listen to what the pawns say. He said what a large a tree. Doubly so with in hand. This is where it was bringing me on the map. Am I gonna do that DLC? Yes, absolutely. I'm very excited for the DLC. I've never played that before, so. Oh, wait, what the hell? Why did that move? Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, wait, nope. Oh, this quest even says to the, to the west. Okay, so both of these quests do line up. I'm not sure what I was following to the south. I was following some quest marker for something. I think it, you know what it might have been? I think it was one of the notification board quests that I had to kill bandits or something like that. Damn it! Alright, let's teleport. That's okay, at least you did the quest. Let's teleport back to Grand Soren, and then we're gonna head out west. Huh. 
There's a guy screaming for help. Oh, okay. I don't remember having that what quest. Do you suppose those stones is a port crystal? One can reach it from anywhere with the use of a magic item. How am I supposed to hear a guy screaming for help when I got Rick Tardis and Shy in my ear? Where shall we head? You know what I'm saying? Like honestly. We don't deal in the we're in honest bit. Oi, there's a they're more like take all the time you like. Do come again. Remember to both buy and sell items. Okay, let's head to the west. <laughs> Mr. Harcourt says Tardis is yapping, Shy is murdering everyone. Hard life. Huh. I will not tolerate Shy slander. That's not very nice, Odessa. To tolerate Tardis slander? You know what? Today I'm going to honor Tardis. Come here, Tardis. Today we're going to treat Tardis with the respect that he deserves. Come here, brother. We're going to give him a free ride through the bandit hills right here. Gregory says, nearly three years ago, I Wolf played a live you, stream of The Witcher 3. I joined, chose to stick around, and have gotten to know some wonderful people. Goal to that. As a base, we ought to be able to travel even further. Do we know if DD2 will have the same use your friend pawn system? Yes, it will. Or the ruins of such. Damn it, Tardis! Hold on. You tired me out. Get him. Oh, great. The city holds every amenity. It would make I think there's like a little bandit hideout right here. Let's use one of those things. Let me use one of these. Amplifies strength for a period of time. Cool. And let's use this one too. And let's give Tardis our convenience. Armed Rose! Get him! They attack in quick succession! Do not just attack right <laughs> now. Now we'll gain you It's most likely what we just want. I'll not have to do You know a game's fun when you're just obliterating enemies, but you're still having fun? I shall restore your health. They attack in quick succession! Let's check out this little area, make sure there's no secrets here. There may be order of use inside. Kinda hard to see in some of these areas, isn't it? Is Shy stealing things from my world to bring back to her world? Is that why you guys accepted my invitation? Such open locales make fleeing from enemies a tricky proposition. Castle walls or the ruins of such. Oh man, I can't. Is it is it is it dusk right now or is it dawn? I think it's dusk. It's about to be nighttime. That's not good. The crags about to get crazy up in here. Better it be us. Careful! A goblin! <laughs> this should change the stakes. Take my fire! Goblin! Watch your step. 
I'm finding it really hard to be in the light encumbrance Bear level. Oh, nice, Shaq. Thanks. Find an opening, then strike. I'll grab it. A goblin. I shall take on the straw. It's weak to fire. Great, we have a goblin blowing the horn right now too. We'll rout them in a single charge. Where's the goblin blowing the horn? Got a wolf den right down there. You know what? Screw it. Fire works well. Oh, that hurt really bad. Oh my god, Rick. Jeez, you don't gotta do that to the goblin. Holy crap. Take my fire! Fire! Lend thy kiss! I have a feeling we're gonna encounter a big bad monster here very Whoa, soon. Let's let's stick to the road. I hear the wolves right now. Hello. Can I help you? Then I uh thank you very much, but my party's full. Come on, pawns, let's go. Move out. Darkness is coming. Think well before striking. Yeah, so nighttime is supposed to instill a sense of fear and intimidation into the player because different creatures come out at night than in the day. So get ready. I shall restore your health. Hold on. Looks like we have a little camp up here. Is it a goblin camp? There, master. Wolves. You'll never hit them. Finally. This should change the stakes. Fire works well. Now. Fire! Lend thy kiss! We'll let that guy go. I'm doing two different quests right now. The bandit leader offered two tasks. Vanquish rival thieves to the west or dispose of a deserter from their gangs. That's what we're headed on right now. And I think actually the thieves' den is also the same... Same quest. A basket of sulfur saurians. What do we got here? We got saurians? I don't see them. Some. Oh, shit. What the hell, dude? Oh, dude. These are the ones that go invisible. That was so cool. They're just sleeping under a tent. Nice shot. Giant Rick are beasts. Let us watch and wait. Leave it to me. Seems it was abandoned here. You think Warrior's the handicap class? I've been having great fun with the Warrior. This feels super powerful. 
I'm gonna be trying a few different vocations, but. This here, hello. I play this game to prepare me for DD2. Should I? That's up to you. You don't have to play this game to enjoy DD2. Uh, the game takes place in a different, different world. Maybe different universe. All within the same lore, of course, but... That's up to you. I think the game's only $6 on sale right now, so... Okay, I think we're going the right way. Hopefully we are. I wish the ambience was a little bit louder for you guys that watch. I don't know why. We don't. We need more audio controls. Maybe we'll do sound effects a little bit higher. Fun equals the only metric you need in the game. Hey, Elder Geek, what's up? There, Appreciate it. Undead warriors. How's it going? Oh shit, we got undead here. Need some enchantments here. Come on, Rick, Tardis, what do you guys got? Let's go. What do you guys got? Give me something. Give me something. Let us strike with fire. That was effective. Just wait. There we go. Thought for a minute Rick was trying to take all the glory there. Show off. Rick's blasting fireballs and I'm standing here. I can't do any damage at all to the damn things because I don't have my fire enchantment. What's up with that, Rick? Each class gains the same amount of stats. Each just distributed differently for DD1. I think DD2 is going to be a little... Lies at the heart of these withered woods. A walking dead there! What is that sound? I think it's just undead. Oh crap, I don't think I want to... Screw it! <laughs> I don't know why I didn't take damage from that. That's what a warrior does though. He doesn't shy away from things like that. It is so hard to see right now. It's crazy how dark it gets in this game. I keep hearing like horses. Fancy. I might want to place a port crystal on this side of the map when we get up here, because this is an entirely different region. I wonder if I can do this without my lantern going out. There's a path here at the water's edge. Being drenched! Nothing wrong with a little moon glow. Okay, I think I'm going the right way. Yeah, I guess we'll go north. We'll follow this. Your ills are cured. Given the look of things, we'd best be well prepared before pressing on. Tardis is 23, I'm 24. Rick is 43. Shy is 63. Location level six for me with the warrior. The domain of the Western thieves. We best tread lightly. These oh, yeah. These parts are proving a greater challenge, to be sure. All right, we're here right now. All right, so we have to vanquish the rival thieves. So I guess we're just going to kill all of them. And also we're going to be looking for the grimoire stored somewhere in the hideout. So get ready, because it's about to get a little crazy here. We're coming up to a thieves' den. wonder if I should dim my, lan my lan uh, lantern. I wonder if that actually works in this game. Like, can you move up to something undetected if you... Bring a lantern if we aim to pass this way by night. The hell was that sound? It's terrifying. I hear like an ogre or something out there. Wolves hunt in packs. Ah, oh, shit. We got wolves. 
This should change the stakes. Tis weak to fire! Fire is vain to wolves! Fire, Master! Strength in numbers Pick that up, Shy, if you don't mind. We have triumph. Takes <laughs> fire! You lucky bastard. Do not just attack blindly. We have no other choice. We yeah, we're getting close to this bandit hideout. Get ready, folks. Idle too long, and the sun may set on our errand. Be wary. Not exactly. We have to go. Sh South and then wrap around to the north, or what? I think these might be bandits right here. Sorcerer. Start with a weak. Yep. <laughs> God bless. That's crazy. I like these double heels though. It's just kind of nice. I shall be you guys got that guy? Apparently Shy is not the greatest at, at shooting in the pitch black. <laughs> I'll take care of him. You guys let your warrior get the job done. Oh, sorry, Shy. Sorry about that. This should change the stakes. There's no way we could have lost. I like those holy daggers. We have triumphed. Yeah, let's push on. I'm gonna go south and wrap to the north to see if we know where we're going here. Leave it to me. Actually, I don't even know. Interesting. Hold on. Is there like a cave entrance right here? What's going on? This is so hard to do at nighttime. Hey Tardis, you don't this mind? Looks interesting. Don't mind jumping down there, do you? <laughs> On my way. I'll have a look around. Oh yeah, I forgot that giving orders to your pawns does change their behavior. True, good thinking. I need like a glider or something right now. I'm tempted to jump down here myself. You know what? As a tr as the true leader of this party right here, I sacrifice myself. <sighs> Alright, it's safe. Come on down. Oh, I went right over that though. Damn, how am I going to get back up now? Oh, that's a bummer. There's a deer right here. What? Okay, we gotta go through the forest. Alright, we're okay. We're not that far. Gotta head this way. Probably stay on the lower side of the ridge. Nope, we'll see if we can get on the upper side of the ridge. We'd best choose our path carefully. I love how you can see the moon glow flowers with the little luminescent Butterflies flying around. Plants of all kind grow at the tree's feet like so many verdant children. You need oil, Rick? Honestly, I don't think I have any extra oil. But I'm just gonna have to be the lantern. Me and Tartus are gonna have to be the lantern holders. Idle too long, and the sun may set on our errand. Be wary.
Okay, here we go. Now we found the Thieves Guild. Oh my... Uh-oh. What are we fighting down there? Go get him, Tardis. Leave it to us! I'll attack the lion's head. Oh shit, it's a freaking Chimera. Get you guys every time with that pronunciation. I got you, Tardis. I got you. Oh my god. We're not doing jack shit to this thing. Take my fire. Has anybody got a little spell to, to wake me up? What's going on here, mages? There we go. Like the beasts. We need but the tail. Any side. Damn it, dude, this is tough. I'm trying to get rid of the serpent first. A boon of light. I can't see the light. The snake spins better. I'll hold the serpent still. I know the goat's the one that heals, but... There we go. Easy dub, man. Easy dub. Fight with all you have. The lion is falling. I shall kill the beast. Take my fire. That was good stuff. Leave it to me. That was real good stuff, folks. That was also a notice board quest too. End. Though it seems a hole stands above us. Let's have a look. Chimera got cooked. Yeah, that fire damage is impressive. Hey, Anonymous. Magic Knight and Magic Archer are so OP they attack your PS3 processor directly. <laughs> you know, actually, let me double check. Let's see what we got here. Freakish main. I forget what Capcom said about the day and night cycle in DD2. It's, I think it's going to be a little bit different than it is in DD1. It's still going to exist, but it's going to operate on different cycles. Or maybe I'm confusing that with Outward. Never mind. I might be confusing the two games. <laughs> How do we get... We take a look at the map. Oh, it looks like we have to... We have like a ridge here, so we have to go probably over here. Let's set down a marker. 
Let's head to that right now. Oh, oh my god! Is this a horror game? Why did that scare the living shit out of me? What the hell is this thing? Strike with holy light! Dude, what is this? We have triumphed. That scared the crap out of me. I did not expect that. See this like dark knight creature come out of nowhere and just stab my creature. I thought it was at first I thought it was like Rick or Shy. My god, my armpits are sweating after that one. Bear Master! Wolves! Forget the wolves. Damn it, I just whipped twice. You guys come with me. This is where we gotta go. Oh, is this the mountain pass where like the ogre is standing on the hill in the distance? This must be the word of the darkest magic. Not this time, Bucko. Mitchellanius, what's going on? Hey, Moss. Let's see if I can fight while looking at the chat. Oh, shit. That was a lot of damage. Wow. I like how some creatures can't actually be lifted in the air. At least it wasn't something much larger. Got gold buff. Fire! Right, come with me, folks. You guys pick up that. We don't take kindly to trespassers. Reach a fire! Fire master! It's fire! I think that wolf fell off the edge. <laughs> pick up that fell lord bone. Oh, did I miss something important back there? I wish my pawns would pick up things a little bit more than they do. What else would you expect with my help? Wolves hunted fell lord's bone. Okay. All right. Is that like good for crafting or something? All right. We can finally put our lantern away because we're running out of oil. So let's get rid of that right now. I really hope in DD2 it's just the press of a button to dim your lantern or put it away. It really better be like a hot, it better be a quick key on the controller. His treacherously so steep. We're going to that thieves' den right there. Looks like we have to follow the ridge all the way around. Let's give Tardis some of these, because he looks like he's struggling. I wonder if he'll eat them automatically. You would think the pawns... Oh yeah, I think he's eating them. Is he? You would think the pawns would eat that stuff to increase their max HP again. Why do I recall an ogre in this part of the map? That's why. <laughs> This is super cool. If you come and do this quest at nighttime and you're walking up this ridge, I, f I remember this from my first run. You just see the ogre and his little club like lit on fire from the distance and you keep getting closer and closer and you realize that you're about to face a beast in the night. What a drop. It's like the open space is about to reach out and take you. Cast a monster down below and it won't soon return. All right. Well, here we go. Tardis, go get him. A cyclops there! Ha! Is that what you have for me? I'll see what see Rick does here. Nice. Nice, Rick. Nice. The cyclops is armored. Snatch up any tusks you break free. Oh my god. I don't even have to play the game with these pawns. We must be warned about its armor. Just wait. We'll see a weakness. Cyclops unarmored. 
They don't completely destroy things. Even though they're way higher level than what my character is, but they definitely do some noticeable increased damage from my other pawns. I'm trying. Oh wow, that's really close to the ledge. That's terrifying. That is absolutely terrifying. Trying to get the helmet off. I don't know if I can. Oh my god, that's so cool how it knocked me back. Such great game mechanics. There's no way we can lost to that. This looks interesting. Name the movie. Name the movie. What's We've done that? this before. Name the movie. Thank you. Thank you, Vince. You go. Thank you. It's like such. It's such a sound bite that I'll just. It's never not in my head whenever I kill an ogre or a troll. This hole is now. <laughs> For a man to meet their leader, mayhap if he wore a woman's kit, our It just fades off into the distance, and you're wondering if Frodo's actually dead because he got stabbed with the pike into the mithril. All right, Rick, what do you got here, man? You got a strategy here? I know you've been here before. Apparently, Shy and Tardis want to go through the front gate. And that's why we brought Rick along. Let me just tell you that much. Did you guys see that precise cut right there where I avoided the barrel? That was impressive. This looks interesting. Dude, Dragon's Dogma is going to be 4x the size of this game in terms of the world size and more populated and densely vegetated. Oh, that's so exciting to think about. Yeah, I've heard 4X a few times. I think one of the one of the Capcom devs actually said that themselves. Thieves master, watch for an opening. Then is that Grand Soren? That is. That's where we came from. This is why not having fast travel all the time is so cool, because we literally made that entire journey, and then just looking back and seeing that is incredible. Like it was a hell of a trek, and we had to fight Chimera. We fought. Goblins, wolves, everything. We got lost. That's what open world games should be about. Oh. Be off with you. Why are you here? Okay, we're not enemies yet. They don't know what we're up to. You don't exactly know what we're up to yet. Let's go. Maybe I can speak to the leader because I don't even know if I want to eradicate this particular thieves guild because that other bandit group wasn't necessarily good either. This fort was built by a duke of old. I Rick Frodo would have still taken a lot of damage from that, but it's still my favorite perhaps. trilogy of all time. Yeah, you know, just just look at it as Mithril being magical. Whenever you can't explain something in fantasy, it 
just boil it down to its magic and I don't understand it. That's what I do. You're in the way outside. My mission is quite literally to eradicate this faction. Um, oh, we ended up back right here. But I'm trying to see if there's something else that we're able to do. We also have to find the grimoire, too. Let me look on the map. Okay. Ancient fort to be sure. Who can say just when it was built? I fear we're not likely to get far speaking with their leader. This looks interesting. Rumors tell of their leader's hatred towards men. We might speak with her. We've we right. no place. Very well. Men. What the hell? Now go. No! What happened? Did I when I ordered my pawns to go, did that mean that they're going to attack? I was just messing with the commands. I was trying to find a wait command. Which apparently doesn't exist in this game. <laughs> well, so much for that. Find an opening, then strike. Okay, I guess we're going guess we're going to war. The only thing I can think of is that the pawns attacked. There's a man in the party, they attack. Oh, they hate men. Okay, that's cool. Interesting. So if I played an all-female party right now, they wouldn't have attacked me. That's kind of, that's kind of interesting. It's like the ogres. A lot of the ogres don't like female characters. But the elder ogres go after the males. Oh, I'll enjoy this too. No! No! Don't you cast spells? What? Are you lucky bastard? Strength in numbers, Arisen. It was a fine scrap, if I may say so myself. All right, I guess we're eradicating the thieves' guild, which I'm fine with that. I so let's keep searching here. Speaking with their leader. Ow! Oh, you can hear the pawns saying, "I don't think we're gonna get far speaking to their leader." That's pretty cool. So, oh, that was Tardis saying that, though. I don't think he has knowledge of this, but. Who can say just when it was built? Take care, you don't fall. There must be a ladder nearby. Let's draw a lantern and have a look. Okay, let's go back up. I shall restore your health. Hold on. Half work, what's up? She attacked because I was a man. Sexism. Bullshit. Okay, we got a couple more up here. Let me see what we're doing. Alright, so inform the bandit leader Maul that you vanquished a number of his rivals. Um Oh, this one's further. Okay, it's actually further to the east. But how close am I to that? 
map is confusing me. Now I have to come down here. Okay, I don't even know what just happened. That's Casardus. Okay, well, we did this quest, so that's good. I think I'm actually going to plop down a port crystal. Hold on, let's see. Oh, no, no, that's not... Yeah, expo the Grimoire is stored somewhere in the bandit's hideout. Search the area and claim the tome. Why does it... Hold on, why does this... Okay, all right. All right, let's lay down a port crystal. If it lets me, I don't know if it's going to let me do it here. Or a fairy stone. Do I have another one? I think I gave it to TARDIS, didn't I? I wonder if there's still a lot. I bet you there is a lot still down going this way. So let's let's Not place this way. down near the gates. An ancient fort to be sure. Free water, what's up, man? You can cross dress and it'll let you talk to them. Yeah, I heard that was a mechanic in the game. That's crazy. Keep watching the falling rocks oh shit! The Bad time to look at the chat. Holy crap. We almost went for a little tumble right there. Alright, let's place down the port crystal right here. All right, so now we can fast travel to here, and we can also fast travel to... We have a fast travel point all the way over here, and then a fast travel point all the way down here to the south also near this one. I like those. Midori, hello. Well, what bow do I have on my pond right now? I think it's the last thing I was doing was upgrading my equipment. Let me take a look right now, Shy. Let's see. Um, Shy. Weapons. Shy, you currently have on the reinforced longbow. Wooden longbow reinforced with iron to lend its arrows added power. And the crimson teeth daggers. Alright, um, let's go ahead and let's port crystal. Oh, there's always one at Casardus too. I didn't even realize that. <laughs> All right, so we want to go to probably... Damn it, dude, the controls in this game. We probably want to go to... What's the closest one? Either Casardus or the one up here, actually. I wonder which one would be quicker. Casardus? Hmm. That one, we have to go through the town and then around. This one, we just go straight. So I'm going to go to the Shadow Fort. Yeah, let's go to that Shadow Fort. Damn it, man. Getting dinner with the parents later. Nice, Vlada. That's always a good time, isn't it? It is known as the Shadow Fort, built to ward against a goblin invasion. All right, so now let's set our quest marker. Sorry, guys. When you guys see me go through the menu like seven times, this game doesn't really have the greatest quality of life in terms of menu interfaces and navigating the menus. It's quite piss poor, actually. I already have a way parker there. Over here. There we go. All right. And also let's select our quest too. Um, no honor among thieves. Yep, that's where we got to go. Perfect. If I had some empty flasks, I would stop at the healing well. By the looks of it, a grand and that's Capcom for you. Goblins dwell nearby, if I recall. It just goes to show you that gameplay comes first and foremost. Like, if the game plays solid, People will overlook quality of life things like that, and it's not a big deal. There's so many games out there now that... ...come out with really good, like, quality of life features with all their men menus and interfaces, but the game sucks. So, you know, I'd rather have it this way. Also, From Software doesn't really have the greatest... Elden Ring's never had the greatest menus or interfaces. And we all complain about it a little bit, but we really don't care, because the game is phenomenal. Shut up. You little biatch. Here 
Goodbye. Oh, nice shot, Shy. Great shot. Wow. That was impressive. Okay, companies need to focus on making their damn gameplay good first. Make the core of the game good. Hey, look at Ubisoft games. You have like all these crazy interfaces and menus and quest markers and the games suck. The for traps. Have I wonder if I can take on the dragon. What do you guys think? I might try to take on this dragon now that I have Rick and Shy with me. Let me see if I can give Rick a few of these real fast. He eats some of these. Rick, you like green warish? I'm going to give you one, man. Take a swig, man. Or chop it down. Or not. It is far stronger than a common goblin. He's a weakling still. Shit. Let's see if Rick cures me this time. Nice. Great job, Rick. Shit, I think the dragon is awakened. Uh oh, that's not good. Oh shit, the dragon's here. Oh my god. Strike the moment it breathes fire. There's nothing. Take aim for its mouth as it breathes fire. I'll go at once. Be healed. Even in numbers, a weakling is a weakling still. There! Its heart lies exposed! Dude, this guy has crazy HP. I don't think I can do this. This should change the stakes. Apparently Rick's out of mana right now. Damn, this was not a good idea. Fly, you fool. Limey says, I play on PC with controller. Me too. I got a PS5 controller right now. I think that's the Haladom spell. Is it going to take it? There we go. Okay. Guys, I don't know about this. This is, uh... This is crazy. Oh, my God! Think well before striking. How do we fight such a thing? Its wings may be vulnerable as well. I cannot move! Cardus isn't doing so hot this fight. No! Strike at his heart! Magic for the win. Yeah, I don't know if I'm taking this thing down. It's not looking too good right now with all these goblins around, too. It's an epic battle, though, isn't it? Supposed to strike at its heart. Oh wow, that was, that's a bad idea to jump on the tail. <laughs> Great game mechanics. All right, let's see if we can get into that tail. I can get a quick heal. Oh shit! Come here, you stupid goblin. I have to res my teammates every two seconds here. I'm not able to do any damage. I was clumsy. Let's get into that heart right now. 
Oh my god, that was a hit right there. His arm is blocking the heart. That's not good. You know what, folks? I don't know about this. Watch out for the towel, TARDIS. Hot damn. It's like, even if I get him down this first one, I'm not even close. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna retreat this. Okay, let's get out of here, folks. Come on, come on, pawns. We'll return another day. Let's see how far this thing follows us. Oh my god, <laughs> terrifying! What a cool looking Drake, though. Some beasts still remain. Not sure if he's gonna follow or how that's gonna work. <laughs> Is the dragon still here or did he leave us alone? He's flying in the sky right there. What if he's guarding something, if that's like his area or something? And all that and I missed. All that and I missed. I like how the warrior can just take hits while I'm winding up for a strike. We'll rout them in a single charge. They're a threat when well unified. Curitable, sir. Fire! Let me its armor. Alright, let's go. Let's get out of here. We got places to I go right now. I wonder if I should go to the healing well, actually. Am I close to it? I am close to it. Let's stop by right there. See if we can get some of our HP back, because we really need it right now. We are routing in a single charge. Burn them to ash. Did it. Was a fine scrap. Come with me, Pons. I have a special place for you. The wood grows thicker. What's up, Cal? How are you? Impressive to get the health down that low for your level. Well, I think I'd like to take credit for that, Shy, but it was probably you and Rick that did that. Few visitors. Hence all the monsters and rare materials. He's a formidable foe. Where is this healing well? It's around here somewhere. Just gonna ignore the goblins. Their kind is weak to fire. I'm on my way. There it is. Keep going, Wolf. Keep going. You can make it. Get into the well. I'll leave the weak foes to you. He just whiffed. He swung above my head because my character... Did you guys notice that? My character was out of stamina. Therefore, his back was bent over. And that goblin took his normal swing and it went over my head. Just incredible. Absolutely incredible. Oh, 
is useless. Wish I wish I had an empty flask. Find an opening and Fire. Damn, Shy, nice. Let's have it over and sealed off. Goblins hate fire. I'll support you. We'll rout them in a single charge. Test my fire. I grant you fire's praise. <laughs> All right, good stuff. Good stuff. Let's head on out. Probably ignore these goblins for a little bit. Their kind hates ice and fire both. I'll go at once. Dude, I'm the goblins right. are everywhere in the hills around the healing well. <laughs> this place has never been touched by man. That horn will draw more of its kind. Oh, I'm aware, Rick. Don't you worry, brother. <laughs> It can be fun if you level right. I've been having great fun so far. The only downside is that there's only three abilities, so I know that at some point I'm going to want to switch here. I'm on my way. Difficult to judge distance when facing foes across such open plains. Very well. <laughs> Leave it to me. Careful! A goblin! A numbers, a weakling is a weakling. Strength in numbers. A goblin is a formidable foe. This should change the stats. I can't see fire's blaze! It's fallen! Strike! Ainsley, thank you for the Twitch Prime. I appreciate you, Take thank you. My fire. And it could be awesome, but it's set to level up HP and defense. You want to level in something like Assassin for 100 levels or so to make sure your two-handed deals good damage. Oh, interesting. Okay. All right, we're going to that fortress right there. I think we're going to take the beach because we haven't been on the coast in a little while. I love the sound of seagulls. It's so ASMR, so relaxing. So disappointed in you for getting me into another video game. You're welcome. Goblins are weak to fire. Tell Rick and Tardis that. You know what I'm saying? Endeavor to be ever calm in battle. Bide your time, then strike. Oh damn. What do you guys say we take these guys out? I like the little goblin helms. These goblins are kind of cute, aren't they? He just did a belly flop under the ground. What else would you expect with my help? That's great. Fire! Lend thy kiss! Careful! A goblin! If I can find a good bow, maybe I'll switch to Strider. Or maybe even Assassin for a little bit. The second half of this session. Oh, damn. Nice. Get up, Good shit. Perhaps it still holds cargo. Just wait. It's fire. We'll see a weakness. Their kind hates ice and fire both. I've been covered in oil. Goblins are cute. Goblins we don't have to always kill fire. them. <laughs> Game doesn't explain it well. 
You're right. But I also think you don't necessarily have to do that either if you're playing on normal mode, you know what I mean? You don't have to min-max your builds. And it's my step. Pray be careful. I think we gotta get to the top up here where the bridge is. This area is likely rich in rabbit and other wild game. All of this for a side quest. They're on I've been having a blast. The road splits here. Let's be doubly sure of which will see us to our destiny. On got oiled up. Yeah. What could it be meant to defend? These goblins are based on the D&D arcade game Shadows Over Mistara, a game I used to speedrun. Interesting. I sense something nearby. <laughs> a bird, perhaps. Or bigger. All right, here we go. There's no easy choice. This fort was built by a duke of old. I have to run to the bathroom real fast, though, so I'm going to let you guys watch the commander here. Okay? I'll give you a nice view of the distance. I'll be right back. Anybody still here? Heard everybody leave. You know what's funny is um, we've talked about this before, but when you're a streamer, when you go to the bathroom, you usually will lose like 10% of your viewership. Maybe less than that. Yeah, I can already see. There's already a dip. I have my graph showing me right now. I usually don't watch view count, but I can see it right now. Every time you go to the bathroom, you have like a dip in viewership. But it takes like a couple years of streaming and content creation to not care about that dip. When you're first starting off streaming, if you have five people watching and two of them leave when you go to the bathroom, it's like the end of the world. <laughs> You've hunted that skulk of vixens to the last, have you? I am glad to be rid of them. My chair kept you guys entertained. With quite the skill arisen. And the strength of will to match, I now see. You have proven your will arisen. In return, I grant you freedom. You're an equal among us now. The freedom to follow your own will where it takes you is a precious thing indeed. Here, bring this whene'er you wish to pass. I shall see you are granted free transit. Well, I've learned what to do in this quest. Woohoo! Let's go, baby. Good stuff. Was an onerous task. I am glad it bore fruit, however strange. Aye, the Grimoire is here with me. Sadly, I've no mind to give it up, nor do I have want of your coin. This dude has the Grimoire. Now, if there were aught I wanted, gold had failed. I would next try steel. Well, have you the metal, sir? I... The Iron Hammer dwells within a hold near the southern shore. See what Shy has to say about that. The Iron Hammer dwells within a hole oh. near the southern shore. Okay. I, the Grim Warrior, sadly I've no. Now, if there were aught I want, well. I... 
objectives are known, we have not to gain from unnecessary combat. I think I killed these guys in my first run. Ah, uh, look at the view. Isn't that incredible, folks? Oh, nice, RM, nice. Hey, I don't mind being in, being on in the background. I appreciate that. This looks interesting. The more people that are watching, whether you're actually here or not, <laughs> helps out the stream because it pushes it to more people in the algorithm, so. You don't gotta be here. You don't gotta fully be here. Alright, let's, um... Alright, a band of thieves has apparently claimed the tome. Head for the territory in the south of Grand. So let's see. You guys think I should just attack these guys or what? The one pawn said that I shouldn't. Climb the broken tower for the quest item. Oh yeah, I kind of remember something like that. Let's let's do a little exploration here. Let me pull out my lantern. Bandits master, pray. Be careful. Let's see what happens here. This looks interesting. Yeah, this is Dark Arisen, but it's but I'm not playing the DLC content, so I'm really playing DD1 at the moment, but it is the Dark Arisen version of the game. That tower would offer a commanding view. Perhaps we can scale it. You took the grimoire and then attacked to get more XP? Brutal, shy. Oh my god. You're just a killing machine. I remember doing that on my first run. Okay, so let's, um, I usually, uh, on my last run, I definitely attack these guys. And when I played this, you know, I played the, like, the last run that I did was the most full run that I've done, because I made it to the final boss, but I did play DD1 before that. I think I even made it to this part. Both times that I've been here, though, I've definitely killed all the bandits here, so we're gonna just leave without them knowing. It's a shame to part with such a rarity. If only we had two copies. Ah, uh, Rick, trying to take my shit? Yeah. You're not forgiven. Let's go out this way. Let's see what the quest says now. Return to Grand Soren and give Salome's Grimoire to Stefan. All right, let's do that. And then, yeah, then we got the main quest after this. Let us report our return to Stefan. Um, we can probably just Fairy Stone, actually. Woo -woo. Let's go, baby. We're turning it. We're tuning in two. We're doing two quests now. Let's go. We're making some serious progress. It is a port crystal. One can a reach it from anywhere with the use of a magic cool. item. Why would anyone just randomly decide this is the place I'll store this book? Well, to be fair, it was really high up Let's in that broken tower. Probably pretty stupid to try to climb that IRL. All right, let's return to Stefan. Um, actually, we're gonna we're gonna take a new pawn on. Is Fate still watching right now? Business with the guild, sir. See what we got here. We're gonna pick up Fate's. We're gonna pick up Fate's pawn right now. He's gonna fire me. I think I'm gonna fire you and Rick. You guys are fired. All right, let's see. Let's, um... Maybe we could pick up Enzaville, too. I don't know if he's here right now, but we could run with Enzaville and Fate for a little bit. Oh, yeah, Romko. Are you still here right now? I don't see Romko in the chat, either. I have to accept his Steam friend request. What's up, Victor? Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and let's go to... We gotta pick up Luality's Pond, too. Let's do, um... Let's see. Adoram right there. Shy Violet we already have. Enzaville, so it's higher Enzaville. Ooh, he's a warrior. And then fate. The pawn is already in the rift. Oh, okay. So the friend pawns actually just show up here. 
Corrupt pawn. Oh, damn it. Enzovils can't be hired. <laughs> Shit. We have to get rid of... We have to get rid of either Rick or Shy. Um, I'm going to flip these crackers, okay? All right. Shy, you're the top of the crackers. The toasty part. Rick is the bottom of the crackers. Here we go. Damn. Is everything in order, Master? You can just keep all the stuff, okay? I'm gonna give you a five star. You did a great job. No comments, though. Rick made it to round two. I'd hope to serve you. May our paths. May our paths cross again, Shy. All right, so let's see. Which one is... This one is Fate Spawn, I believe, right? Wasn't it Airy? Oh, shit. I'm going to be running with three mages? Yes, Arisen. Three mages. We should give it a try. Why not? Let's see what happens. I am honored to travel with you. Oh, look at Fate's character. Looking so purdy. All right. Three mages and a warrior. <laughs> it actually might not be bad. No, everybody's a mage. Rick's a mage. Tardis, my main pawn, is a mage. Fate is a mage. I don't think it said sorcerer for fate, right? Get a sorcerer. No. We're going to try three mages right now. Seems this is where the merchants live. It's quite open. Salomed was a scholar, the leader of a council of sorcerers. He was a genius, a luminary, until the day he went mad. He put the fruit of the council's research to the flame and disappeared. I, geniuses are so off touched with madness. But enough of him. I care only about the tome he kept with him in his research. I would make it mine, sir. Even if it means sifting through the muck to find it. Yes, this is it. At long last, Salomet's grimoire is mine. It wears a humble look. But there's an aura of such power about it. It is a wonder. My thanks, sir. Truly, I must do art to repay this kindness in the future, should we meet again. I've gained quest knowledge. It was a term of considerable well power. To have the tome. I love Fate's character. Remember to save enough for lodging. <laughs> I have your pick. Any? What will it be today? I do want to try that curse out. What will it be today? Have your pick. Any you like. What will it be today? An advanced form of savage lunge that charges with an increased range, undeterred by enemy attacks. Let's pick that up. Escape slash. Steps backward in a swift evasive maneuver while delivering a... There is another ability. Wait. Offers the flat of the blade to allies as a platform to propel off of. I don't think my mages are going to need that, but I'm going to pick that up right now. Catapult blade. That's an upgrade. Act of atonement. Holds the blade at the ready. The user is left vulnerable, but all damage taken lends power to a devastating counterattack. up wyvern 
What do you guys think? You guys think I can make it work with TARDIS, Fate, and, and Rick? Or am I going to get my ass kicked with three mages? Oh, so there is more than three abilities, but you can only access three of them at a time? Is that what's going on here? All right, if I had to get rid of one, let's get rid of the pom... Oh, man, the pommel bash is so good, though. We're going to get rid of it. We're going to grab... An advanced... Hmm. We're going to grab Indomitable Lunge. Um... And then Savage Lash is that really strong, powerful one. We'll get rid of that for a little bit, and I'm going to grab Active Atonement, the Curiosity. Okay, and then let's go... What will it be today? Um, four skills. Nice. I have a lot. Pretty much own everything for the Warrior. Could save some of my discipline for... For the next vocation that we go into. Arc of Might. Channels a vast amount of strength into the ultimate blow. Requires protection of one's allies while preparing. What? What is that? Pierces the air with a roar that draws nearby enemies' attention. Why can't I access both of my skill bars with the warrior? Is it because it's too powerful? That's weird. Like, why can't I put the taunt on my other... All right, we have Active Atonement. I actually am thinking about getting rid of Whirlwind Slash, too. Now let's completely change it up. Arc of Might is the MVP of Warrior Skills. You know, I, I want to use it, but I'm thinking I don't want it while I have um, three mages right now, but... Because you only have one weapon? Yeah, well, Wizards only have one weapon, right? Why can't it work like that for uh for warriors? What will it be today? Right? What will it be today? Uh, let me see if I can upgrade what Active Atonement actually. Zach, thank you so much for the five gifted over on YouTube. Thanks again, man. Appreciate it. I'm so curious as to what this is now. Warrior is the guts class. Okay, let's just run with what I have right what now. Will it be today? Take our time. Um, pick, and then line. let's see what we got what for Tardis. Learn skills. Tardis is going to learn... Rick already has combustion. Grapnel. Sends forth tendrils of dark energy. That sounds pretty cool. Sure, we're going to let Tardis learn that. Then we're going to upgrade it. Um, I actually need Tardis to learn... I Haladom for when Rick actually leaves the party, so we're going to pick that up. Thanks, Zach. Appreciate that, man. A lot of gifted memberships from Zach lately, that's for today? sure. Okay. What will it be today? I didn't even look at what Fate has for her pick? skills. Any you like. I wonder if I, I bet you, you know what? Let's, let's switch Tardis's heal. Today? Let's get rid of Tardis's heal. Because Tardis. Oh, sorry. It Damn it. You, what will it be today? Because I bet you Fate also has the heal. So let's get rid of High Anodyne and let's put up. We already have High Brontide, High Grapnel. Yeah, we'll do that. Perfect. What will it be today? Have your pick. Any you like. Come again soon. All right, let's head out. Where's everybody at? We got Rick, we got Fate, and we got Tardis. Good shit, Tardis. You're doing a great job. It was a tome of considerable power. He must be well satisfied to have it. All right, let's um, let's rest to morning time. <laughs> have your pick. What will it be today? Understood. And then we're gonna go talk to Sir Maximilian. Not all the same vocations will exist in DD2. Uh-oh, what's going on right now? Never experienced this before. Can't believe Enzaville's pawn is corrupt. Complete? 
What did Enzivel do to become so corrupt? You know what I mean? I thought he was a good guy. I really would like to find a better two-handed sword. You know? Maybe this guy sells a better one now. It doesn't look like he does. Oh, he does. <gasps> oh my god. Yes, yes, yes. Wow, I can use a hammer too. Let's grab the steel great sword. Change equipment. Let's go ahead and put that on. Awesome. And then we're going to sell. We're going to sell that sword. Also that too. Get rid of all this dead weight. Even though I upgraded it twice, that's fine. Fell Lord's Bone, I don't really know what that's used for. We're just going to hang on to it for now. Then we're going to enhance the Steel Great Sword to level 3. Holy crap, let's go. So it looks like some of these weapon enhancements require different materials that you find in the world, like those rugged tusks. But I think this is actually quite nice. Some games don't do this. It seems like it pulls directly from my storage in the inn. I don't have to, like, figure out items, run back to the storage, come back out here. That's what it seems like it's doing. Should we upgrade TARDIS's Jester Cap? <laughs> yeah, we'll upgrade TARDIS's Jester Cap. <laughs> I don't know if I could ever take that off, to be honest with you. He, TARDIS is wearing leather shoes right now? Oh my god. All right. Wow, look at my new sword. Holy crap. That's, oh, I gotta be careful swinging that thing in, in the courtyard. Easy to while away hours just shopping. Yeah, how you doing? Head out. Have you Mephistopheles, hello. Yeah, Zach was giving away some memberships. Yeah, Outward 2 is major hype, Mr. Hardcore. I'm so excited for that. I'm so excited. I think we got another year or two before we actually see the game, but that's going to be a fantastic experience. I can't wait. I hope that it blows up. Outward 1 actually did fairly well because they were a 10-man team. 10-person dev studio, and they sold over a million copies, which is incredible. And they're independent and self-publishing. So Outward 2, hopefully it's a great success. It will be my honor. The choice is you give the word. All right, just to catch you guys up, the quest that I'm doing right now is... Meet Father Geoffrey in the Grand Soren Cathedral for information on the survey mission. We have to protect a survey party investigating ruins that may offer new insights on the dragon. This way! Whoa, Fate's kind of bossy. Jeez, Fate. Oh my god. We're coming. Me and Tardis are kind of slow. You gotta give us a couple minutes. New weapon looks like the old one. No, it's just, it's better. Okay, just just admit it. It's better. Well met, good arisen. It is a heartening boon to have your assistance in our endeavors. I will not keep you long, for the survey party has already set out from Grand Soren. They walk south to the ruins of the falls near the encampment. All right. I know not what dangers await there, but I will rest easily knowing you accompany them. Pray fly now to their side and keep watch over them. Make her speed your steps, sir. I... Godspeed. Godspeed, priest. What you say. Then you seek the water guard's altar. Follow me, Arisen. Who am I following? Was that Tardis? I think that was Tardis' voice. Well, show me the way, brother. Oh, that's a weird way to say follow me. This pawn can lead you to the ruins behind the falls. Well, what pawn? Ruins cloaked by a waterfall. We could well use a guide. This place serves as a hub among the land's ab- Not the- For all those who eye the arisens, perhaps the fort lies in those pawns you write about with. Like a little pawn lore. The survey party set out for the falls. I pray go and keep them- I don't know who the hell just told me they could leave me there. I think it was TARDIS, but I just don't even know. But let's go. We'll leave when you are ready, Master. 
I think I'm good to go. We're lightweight. Perfect. Lightweight. Check the map real fast. All right. Um, is that, is that, is that the waterfall? I think it is. I think I do remember a waterfall being right there. Okay. So let's port crystal to, yeah, I don't feel like going through the ruins again. Let's port crystal to Casardus. I haven't been there in a while. And then we'll go north. What's up, Micah? Look forward to seeing your Let's Play, Dragon's Dogma 2. Well, I'm not, it's not guaranteed that I'm going to do a Let's Play series yet. I'll definitely be doing a Let's Play live stream series. But as for a dedicated video series, I'm not entirely sure yet. There's a few factors that come into play. I would love to do it, but... A couple things have to line up in order for that to be beneficial for my channel. The roads are sacred I would love to do it. I love doing Let's Plays, but... If you want to grow Careful, a YouTube channel and make a living, you can't always do everything that you love. Just don't work out like that. <laughs> but be on the lookout for it, because hopefully I can do it. These are my new attacks. Hold on, we gotta we gotta get used to them. That's pretty cool. I am so happy that the warrior has more abilities than three. I thought that's what you guys were telling me, but what you're telling me is you can only equip three at a time. This is really cool that they have more abilities. It's a shame that I can't access my other my other uh, hotkeys, though. Georgie, thank you so much for the five gifted. Welcome to the five new channel members. Actually, ten total if you include Zach. Game needs a berserk sword mod. I grant you fire's blade! Fire! All right, let's give these a quick try. Let's see what these abilities are all about. So we have Indomitable Lash. That's what I had before, but upgraded, right? I think so. Oh my god. I can do a double charge with it now. That's what that ability did. Holy shit. Let's try it out. Oh. What? My pawns are never going to let me try it out. Alright, so we have that. Then we have Indomitable Lunge, which is this one. Really cool. And then Act of Atonement. Let's see what this is all about. Apparently this is the staple of the warrior class. Oh wait, no, that was, it's not the staple of the warrior class. I didn't pick up that particular skill. This one is, I think I activate it, then I wait for an enemy to attack me, and then it does an auto counter attack, is, the, is, from, is what I understood from what I read. Oh, maybe that's just the counter attack, just like that. The rocks here may the door. Oh, okay. I can let go of it too. Maybe for a more powerful effect I'm supposed to let go, but not sure. Micah, thanks for the $2 super chat. Super sticker. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. I like the little wolf cat thingy. Ark is the staple? Okay. We'll get that next time I come back to town. Damn it, I'm out of stamina. Please don't overdo it. Do worry, I am here. Good thing large swords go right through us. I kinda That's like this. Steady. Three mages and a warrior. The ultimate tank group. Wait, am I going the right way? Yeah, I'm going the right way. We are a vagabond people. The encampment was a humble enough place before the attack. Now. Act as a counter? Okay. Seems like it can also be used offensively too, right? Because it swings my sword, which would hit enemies, but yeah. That makes sense, though. I think its most powerful feature is the counter attack. This encampment serves as a fine bulwark against monsters. Split 
it's here. Let's be doubly sure of which will see the destination. Armed bandits are risen. What? Anybody else want to mess with me? This should change the stats. Let's try the act of atonement. Come on, come on, Pons. Let me do it. Let me do it. Are you alright, Master? I wonder if I have to have good timing. Not exactly sure how that works. It's definitely not automatic. Recharge, baby, recharge. Don't worry. I am here. Oh yeah, the quest guidance I think is I think it's almost perfect in this game. Like you do get some guidance as to the area that you need to go, but they don't always tell you exactly what you need to do. You have to listen to your pawns and actually engage with the world, so it's definitely not like Skyrim. But it's also not as hard as like Outward either. Sorry about that. I think I just killed that guy. Fireworks well. You bastard. Damn wolves. Sometimes you do what you gotta do. I don't even feel like fighting the wolves. I'm just gonna ignore them. Did that wolf just tackle fate? Are you kidding me? Now we'll gain the upper hand. Damn, I'm whiffing a lot right now, aren't I? Yeah, we're getting to the waterfall. We gotta help out this research team. I hear your wounds. I always want to get that apple down, but I can never reach it. It's uneven footing. Watch your step. Mind the depth of the water arisen. It is easy to slip on an inline like this steep master. Class is just bunny hop and true. Hey Jackie. <laughs> The ruins are just ahead, Rizzo. Dragon's Dogma Online? Yeah, I wish I played that one back in the day. It's a shame that it never really took off. Quite the grand structure. A wake castle, perhaps? Alright, we've arrived at the waterfall. Question is, how do you get down there? Without dying. Why does my character look so funny right now? Treasure, perhaps? That's one way to get down. Leave 
this way to the water god's old <laughs> That was close. Quite the cascade. I'd not like to attempt that fall. Terrain is wild and buried here. Best yep, this is a new playthrough, path. Xander. Parts 1 and 2 are both available on the channel under the live tab on the channel homepage. Care to find out where this path leads? <laughs> Thank you, Fate. Restore your health. Thank you, Hold Rick. On. Wow, you guys are awfully generous. I'll make her be good. Are you the Arisen, sir? I am of the party sent to survey the ruins. I've seen no sign of Brother Jean. He had gone on ahead. I dearly wish I could run to his aid, but as you've seen, I am the Faith's greatest craven. I beseech you, sir, find Jean within and see him safe. I feel Sure, I'll find Jean within. <laughs> French people. Take care, you are in soaked in water. Warriors can swing their swords on mineral deposits. Oh, that's pretty cool. Alright, lanterns out, folks. Wonder if fate comes with a lantern. Scholars Excuse me, of the fate. Faith gave the water god's altar its name. Fate Long looks ago. like an elf. Wouldn't have expected any less. I love how none of my pawns help me out with the bats. Just me. Also, they say, in truth, no one knows for sure who built this place or why. Excuse me, Rick. Some big ass rats. This looks interesting. You guys see Tardis's black tendril Strike spell? It's pretty cool. Holy light. Hmm, what's that? Leave it to me. Go back the way I came real fast. Looks like I missed a little. Or is that the entrance? Nope, we missed a little turn right here. It's too narrow to pass through. Too narrow to pass through. Okay, it is too narrow. I can hear the. Swift. Be wary. I can hear the lizard folk down there. I love the weapon enchantments. Sorry about that, Mr. Rat. Would that we could get this lift moving. Flooded. 
I believe there is a lever on the lowest floor. <laughs> Treasure, perhaps? It's a one-handed sword for the fighter, I believe. Monsters are risen! Ready yourself! Find an opening, then strike. Just wait. We'll see a weakness. The lizards. What do you think is my first rodeo? Come on, come on, baby. Come on. These guys are frightened of me. They won't even move. Oh my god. Oh my There's god, dude. In. Absolutely insane. Leave it to me. Give me time. Why does fate always say leave it to me when we find treasure? Hmm. Starting to wonder, fate. What your true goal is joining my party. Warrior is definitely one of my favorite vocations for sure. I think I've played mostly Strider my previous run. Strider and Magic Archer. Oh my god, I'm out of oil. Shit, I should have... Crap, who has the lantern? Tardis does. Tardis, give me your lantern. Oh, he has two lanterns. Nice. Awesome. Good shit, Tardis. I take it back. I take back a lot of things that I said about you, Tardis. I'll take that. Really do. Tardis ain't half bad. <laughs> Character's gonna be so over and cumber here soon. Have we sufficient curatives? Gotta pick up the skull. And Strider's super fun because. You have all that stamina to climb up on the back of... Wait, did I miss something down here? You have all that stamina to climb up on the back of monsters and hang out up there. Yes, there is crafting in this game. You can combine items, but I don't really know much about it, Victor. I haven't really done it. Not necessary, but I do plan on jumping into the crafting at some point in this playthrough. Think well before striking. Do not just attack blindly. Let's drain this water as well. A strong flame may take it out. Ice is vain to Sorian! That was close. 
Oh, I don't think I'm dead. <laughs> oh, shit. Not the greatest platform to fight on, right? God, that took care of its tail. Holy crap. That was a fully powered up indomitable lash. Right on the tail. Instant kill. There goes the naked deathless run. So much for that world record. is surprisingly very short yeah i think the main story yeah people are telling me like 16 to 30 hours people typically spend but you can keep playing after the game's over and a lot of players find great enjoyment in that so like i'm gonna be way over 16 hours i think i'm already at 16 i've barely done anything all well, depends on how you play it I didn't see anything. Should I try this? Oh my god. Nobody tosses a dwarf. A massive creature lurks just beyond. No words need to be spoken. No words need to be spoken after that. Damn, I don't have any green warish. Oh, I do. Let's give this to Wolf, too. Tormented, what's going on? Happy Saturday. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> hey, Carly, don't do you, do you mods have the ability to add? Oh, you do have the ability to add quotes. I see Tardis added quote number nine. Haven't been paying attention to that. 
There's a couple more Twitch features that I have to implement for you guys. And I'll get on that very soon. Alright, let's see what this is all about. What do we have here? Cyclops! Shit. Oh damn. He's a big boy. He's a big boy. There's nothing. Just wait. We'll see a weakness. Aim for its weapon arm. Aim for its weapon arm, okay. God bless, what is going on right now? Fuck it with lightning! <laughs> Oh my god, I destroyed that guy. That's the fastest I've ever killed a Cyclops before. Strength in numbers, Arisen. There's no way we could have lost. Right, pick that. all that shit up, Tardis. Leave it to me. Lily, how are ya? I'll heal your wounds. Our favorite New Zealander. We have any we have anyone else in chat that's from New Zealand? Twitch or YouTube chat? What's this? This looks interesting. Come on, Tardis, pick it up. Damn it. Okay, it's just right here. Hmm, what's that? Water God's altar key. All right, let's come back this way. This way. A monk's remains. We'd best oh, that's John. This. Apparently, he died. The monk's robes and blood. Tis certain he's dead. Best go tell the other. The fun little dungeon. Can you guys believe DD2 is only a couple weeks away now? It'd be so much fun. Yeah, we found a shy violet ring. Should hang on to these rings when I face certain creatures. Probably a good idea to switch up like rings that give you certain resistances. Hmm, what's that? Isn't there a way that I can get the water level down? I thought there was like... I have that little gem that I picked up. Or maybe I come back and do that. That was risky. Let's go back. Maybe I'll try out the Mystic Knight at some point. That'd be pretty fun. You have that ring on your character, Shy. Nobody else from New Zealand? Really? 
You usually have a couple that are watching the streams. Dragon's Dogma Paladin. Yeah, it's pretty badass. Wonder if it's still nighttime. The door is making it seem like it's daytime. Sorry if you guys can hear music in the background. My neighbor is playing a uh, playing music really loud right now. Entrenched. Out goes the lantern. Jean, dead. I, I see. This three mage and a warrior party seems to be going pretty good. I, I do not wish his death to be in vain, sir. I will do all I can, please. Might you survey these ruins in his stead, Arisen? Mm -hmm. I knew we had to come back in. That he may know some small comfort in seeing his work here completed. I ask your aid, sir. I... All right, back into the ruins we go for a full <laughs> investigation. Need to level Sorcerer to go Mystic Knight. Oh, is the Mystic Knight like an advanced one that's not unlocked right now? You have to... Yeah, I see what you're saying. Hate how you... Hate how you have to put it away and then... I don't really understand that. You put it away and then you take it back out when it gets doused in water. Aha, this is where the gem goes. Do we know for sure that Mystic Knight is discarded on two, though? Do we know 100% with 100% certainty that we only have 10 vocations? Let's have a look. Oh, God. See ya. Say so myself. Don't touch my gold, Tardis. I hear your words. You dare touch my gold. Confirmed? Okay. I think they gave an interview and said the 10 they've revealed are it. Okay. All right. So I put the main lantern on my main pawn. You can do the turning on this and off. Oh, that's a good idea, actually. I mean, TARDIS has one on. I still find it a little bit dark, though. Especially since I'm playing the warrior. Like, I like to be front line and be able to see things. TARDIS isn't really staying with me. <laughs> Oh crap, I didn't mean to do that. This will restore a bit of health. Tardis just got killed. Definitely have to switch up my skills a little bit because all three of the skills that I'm rocking right now are pretty slow. I gotta get a quicker one. I kind of miss my pommel strike. Let's scatter those bones. Strike with holy light. Human bones that move on their own. Feel dumb for just realizing you can hotkey the lantern. I shall restore your health. I don't know if you can do that on controller. All right, so I think I remember weight also affecting the speed at which pressure plates go this down, or if your character's like too light, you can't do it. This area. And then also the more pawns that you have stand on something can also affect that too. And all of that comes back to character creation, which is really cool.
Yes? Okay. Knew I was right. Oh, sorry for the little spin right there, folks. I wish you could select multiple items at once. That would be huge for this. Barely affecting my character's weight, too. That damn sword, it weighs 1.65. Let's give that to TARDIS. And also give things to Rick and Fate, too. And then just pick them up after. Sir Coat. Now let's give that to Rick. Gotta make sure to transfer things over when I'm done. There we go. That's gonna save. Save us. Oh no. Save us a little bit here. I think I just have to settle for being average weight. I feel like I recall facing something down here like water wisps or something that are like immune to like every damage type except one. This looks interesting. We're gonna find out. Oh, Game there they are. No common phantom. How do we kill him? How do we kill him, folks? Come on, Rick. Come on, Fate. Give me the answers. Uh. Oh, we mustn't oh. allow that spell to be cast. The possessed cannot free themselves. Stay close. Shit. Being drenched. It's over. Oh, it's just magic. Okay. Damn it, dude. My lantern keeps going out. I'm gonna put it away and then put it back on. I shall restore your health. You. What is this nonsense? <laughs> Gotta stay away from waterfalls, that's for sure. Skeleton knights. <laughs> Just wait. You'll see a witness. Stop this incantation! <laughs> My spells are sealed! That'll take care of him. Guess I brought the right party if we needed magic, didn't I? Must stay calm. One at a time. Oh shit. Charge! Throw it off balance. Damn, Rick is an aggressive mage. Holy crap, jumping on the ogre's head. Do not just attack blindly. 
Freaking strike, dude. A cyclops is susceptible to magic. Yeah, definitely has something to do with their personality traits for sure. I'll heal your wounds. Hmm, what's that? Risky mage, what's going on? Really? Oh my god, those weigh so much. That's crazy. Why does my lantern keep going out? God, this is so annoying. Then you have two different menus, too. I think I need to add oil, actually. It must be out of oil. Yeah, they're both out right now, so... Oh, I do have a flask of oil. Let's go, baby! Okay, we should be good for a little while now. As long as I don't run under a waterfall. Don't go chasing waterfalls. <sighs> Hot damn, I'm getting sweaty up in here. Felt so good to sing that. I just don't get this counterattack at all. Oh, you're right, Lester. Find an opening and then strike. Harris is just whipping around those dark tendrils like it's his job. What kind of is his job, isn't it? Get out strength by this guy right here. One at a time. Get it. Strength in numbers are just leave it to me. Damn lanterns. I shall restore your health. Hold on. Anytime. I'm gonna just hold a torch. You've my support. How do I get over there? Watch out, pawns. Was a fine 
if I may say so myself. That was a hell of a jump. Goodbye, Sesame. Yeah, tell your mom we all said hi. that fate started carrying her weight we gave her an altar stone probably quite literally as her carrying her exact weight <laughs> probably weighs just as much that's a nice little convenient chest to drop down on right there all right we got one more to get i wonder what's inside Indomitable lashes broke. Yeah, dude, that shit's powerful as hell. You gotta be shitting me. This looks interesting. How do those torches work? I never tried those before. I thought I had those little sticks. I don't see them anymore. stuff guys good stuff we did it just gotta find my way back now somehow we gotta find our way back I think this might be it be terrifying. As these often house engraved slates and other ancient texts. Some have held revelations of vast importance. If you see any within, pray, bring them to me. Oft times, age will splinter the slates. It is quick. Thank God I can access my pawn's inventory. Mm, yes. As the slate is joined together, the text becomes clear. I will not rest until its meaning is deciphered, sir. For the sake of Brother Jean. Yes. The faith will see it done. In that, you may believe. Ooh, we get a little cutscene here. I like it. You have my thanks, Arisen. I shall break the sad news of Brother Jean's sacrifice to Father Geoffrey myself. It was no fault of yours, sir. You've done your duty by us well, as the father shall hear. 
pray, do not let it weigh upon your heart. Go and tell Sir Maximilian of our success. Yeah, back to Grand Soren we go. I feel more familiar with this quest now. That ends our task. Shall we to Grand Soren? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Wish we could do that IRL. That would be pretty cool. To support crystal. One can read it from anywhere with the use of a magic item. Alright, we have to go tell Sir Maximilian what we just did, but first let's stop at... The courtyard. The Palm Guild stands ahead. It is a gathering place for my life. Me, I, the master works all. The master works all. I love the music here. Freakish claws are worth 2300 each, so is the Fulgrin ore. I'm going to save all of that. Master works all, you can't go come again. This inn can serve as the hub of our <laughs> I have your pick. What will it be today? Pick. What will it be today? Act of Vengeance. An advanced form of Act of Atonement. The blade is held at the ready, leaving the user vulnerable, but damage is channeled into an even greater counter. I still haven't gotten that to go off yet. And we have Battle Cry for the Taunt. Angie, what's up, man? My opinion on 30 FPS for consoles? I mean, I think that sucks. I wouldn't want to go back to 30 FPS. Um, but I think it's supposed to be 60 if you play on 1080, right? I haven't done enough research on that. I think if you play on 1080, which is what 80% of probably gamers play on, I think you can get 60. Which is fine, if that's the case. Spark Slash. Spins the blade in a swift circle. Oh yeah, let's pick that up. Beautiful. Corona Slash. An advanced form of Spark Slash that carves through foes in a broader radius. Awesome. Yeah, we'll give that a try. Oh, damn it. Oh, man, I could have picked up some of these augments right here. Halves the severity of wounds sustained. So tankier. Makes you harder to knock off your feet. Damn, dude. Those would have been great to pick up. Let's get rid of Active Atonement, even though I still have to figure out how to use it. And I'm going to grab Corona Slash. I like Indomitable Slash. Then Indomitable Lunge was okay. Let's do... Offers the flat of the blade to allies as a platform to propel off. Let me enable that, just because it's going to be really funny to use that. You're going to watch me like do something, and I think the pawns are going to jump off me onto the boss's head. Is what I'm assuming will happen. What will it be today? Alright, and then TARDIS has... Might as well just get all the spells for TARDIS. We want to have them all available. Okay, that's good for now. We can't do our other pawns. What will it be today? Have your pick. Let's go ahead and In rest until morning. What will it be today? Understood. I think next session I'm gonna switch to a different vocation. 
and mess around a little bit with something else. Arc of Might. Yeah, I didn't buy it, did I? Here we can rest, manage inventory and skills, and so on. Yeah, I remember creating Tardilly, because Tardis was offensive. Yeah, that was a different game. What what game was that? Wasn't that Hogwarts Legacy? That was Hogwarts Legacy where you weren't able to able to name your little animals Tardis. It had to it had to be Tardilly. Alright. Let's head out this way. Um, Corona Slash. Let's check it out. Oh my god, that's gonna be one of my faves. And then Ladder Blade. Whoa, that's so cool. Whoa! No way! I don't think that works too good with a party of mages, but I am gonna be switching out my pawns here in a second. Uh oh, careful. We're gonna end up hitting a citizen and going to jail. <laughs> the life of a That's freaking great, man. I can't wait to test that out with a different pawn. Have your pick. What will it be today? Yeah, we still. All right, next time I come in here, I'll buy Arc Arc of Might what for sure. Have your pick. Come again soon. Faux show, folks. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Yeah, get the hell out of my way. All right, Fate and Rick. It's been a great experience so far, but I hate to tell you, it's time for you guys to move on. You can summon this with the guild, as necessity demands. It's time for you guys to move on. I'm sorry. It was a great run. You guys both did great. Five star reviews for both of you. Come here, Rick. Great job. You outperformed TARDIS in every master? single category possible. You know what? I'm going to give Rick a gift. Let's give him a beast steak. Yeah. There you go, brother. Appearance rating, five. Battle rating, five. Helpfulness, five. No comments needed. That's so cool that you can see, like, your ratings from other I players. All right, Fate, where are you at? Just back to me and old TARDIS. Uh, Ari? Fate, are you around here? I don't see you. Oh, there you are. Is everything in order, Master? I am so sorry. God, Fate did so good, too. If you should ever... Maybe we'll keep Fate for another mission. Let's see. <laughs> Enzaville is corrupted. I'll accept Ramco's friend request after today's session. Wonder Will, Laura Croft. I don't know what Amanda. Oh, that's Vulcan's pawn. Okay. Uh, let's call in. Let's see if Luality's pawn is here. Oh, I can't. Wait, so can you not use somebody else's pawn when they're playing? Is that what that means? It's only when they're offline. Is that how that works? Because Loyalty is probably streaming right now. She's probably live. Is that how it works? I figured you could just hire them at any time, but I guess that would make sense because... So what would happen though, Rick, if you tried playing Dragon's Dogma and I had your pawn summoned in my world? What would it do? Would it just take it away from you? You can summon, summon someone who's already in the room with you. Yeah, I can't wait to try out Active Might. You get them while your friend is offline, I think. And yeah, what happens if your friend goes online? I could log into mine after you got a copy. Oh, okay, all right. Oh, uh, let's call in Don's. Let's call in Adoram's character. You guys know Adoram. He's a he's a channel mod on YouTube. His name is Adoram Ontario. Let's see what he's all about. He's only level eight. Oh shit. Well, let's just see what he looks like. I don't think he's hired, though. <laughs> Where is Adoram? Damn, Don, you got some work to do. You got some real work to do. She looks great, though. I'll give you that. Ain't hiring no level 8 pawn. You gotta be kidding me. Um... Arida Enzaville's pawn is currently... Oh, wait. Look, I can get Luali's. Wait. Greasy, level 24. <laughs> Greasy, what a name. 
my god. <laughs> Alright, let's get Luality's pawn. She is on... Is Luality streaming right now? Should be live on Twitch and YouTube. I think this is her stream hours. Oh, I can't. Let me check my phone, because it might be letting me take her pawn. Let me check Twitch right here. She's primarily a Twitch streamer over YouTube. She's like me. She started multi-streaming on YouTube when Twitch opened up their rules. I started multi-streaming on Twitch when Twitch opened up their rules. Yeah, Luality is live right now, but apparently we're able to get her pawn, so let's go ahead and see. Uh, Greasy, is this another mage? Is it already in the rift? Oh, I see what you're saying, Shy. Yes, Arisen. Let's take a look right here. Wow, looks like a princess. Grand Ingro, ne oh my god, necromancy? What? Summon the souls of the departed to surround the user, assisting with attack and defense? High Lastitude, an advanced form of Lastitude that calls forth a larger, longer-lasting fog that inflicts torpor upon foes who enter. Oh my god. Yes, Arisen. Yeah, that's sick. I am honored to travel with. Alright, I can't wait to use that. that. I didn't know necromancy was a thing in this game. Um, we don't want... Damn it, I'm so sorry, Fate. We have to get rid of Fate. I don't want to do three mages again. Is everything in order, Fate, I'm going to rehire you very, very soon for top gold. You did such a fantastic job. And I'm going to give you... Let's see, what do you deserve? A moldy apple? <laughs> I'm going to give you an egg, okay? Can't go wrong with an egg. We'll give you a five for appearance, battle five, helpfulness five. Absolutely. We love Fate. Fate's got a great voice too. We heard Fate's voice on uh whose stream was it? I don't remember. I hope to serve you adequately. Somebody's stream. Shy stream? I don't know. May our paths cross again. I can't remember. But we did hear Fate before. Okay, so now we have to I have two mages. Tardis is my mage. Uh Greasy right here is a mage, but also has like some really cool necromancy spells. Um, hold on, is she is running? In order, master? Is she running the heal? She's not. Perfect. Okay. Is everything in order, if you should ever need it? So I think we probably want an archer. I might have to get Shy back in the group. I'm not gonna lie. Who is this guy? Who is Garrus? Level 37? Who is that guy? Hold on. Garrus is is S Hughes 91. I don't know who that is on YouTube. But let's hire. Let's hire. Let's see what Garrus is all about. That looks pretty sweet. Looks yes, like an orc, too. Actually. I am honored to travel. S. Hughes, you watching right now? Probably not. Okay, exit the rift. Here we go. Yo, my name is Great Outs because I'm already in the rift. All right, let's see what we got here. Take a look you at our new pawns. pawns as necessity demands here at the pawn guild. <laughs> look at Luality's character. Like, what an outfit. Holy crap. I feel like I got to pull out, like, a bed and set her on and pick it up and put it above my head and start walking around. Holy crap. <laughs> we have been outdressed, folks. Now, Need to get back into streaming. I feel left out. We don't got a stream to have a pawn. Just gotta play this game. All right, um, let's do. Oh, yeah, we gotta go to the upper district where the rich folk are. Can't wait for DD2. I, st I still think I have a good idea, so you guys consider this. Make make your main character in DD2 a different character than yourself. Don't RP yourself, okay? Make your main pawn yourself. Make the main pawn look like you, or the way you want yourself to look in a fantasy world. Because <laughs> let's face it, none of us look like our actual pawns. Except Taurus. And that way, when we hire out pawns, we can feel like we're adventuring with the other person. 
I already started working on my DD2 main pawn, Wolfheart, and I'm trying to make him look as much like me as I possibly can. I'm not having good luck so far. You have my thanks, sir. Terrible thing what happened to that monk. There was naught for it. The Faith, as all humankind, are victims in the madness wrought by the dragon's coming. That fear of the worm should drive a man to die in pursuit of old stones. <clears throat> I forget myself. At day's end, the Duke has gained more of the knowledge he so ardently seeks. Tis a victory. Awesome. Okay, so now we have a couple more quests to do before we can get in there, but let's, um... Do you have to turn in notice board quests? Or do they just auto? I think they auto-complete. But actually, I think this is going to be a good stopping point for tonight. I might actually go live later tonight. We'll see. I'm really addicted to this game right now. I've been having such a great time. Um... But I need to eat some food. I screwed up my intermittent fasting yesterday by streaming until 1 in the morning. It really messed up my eating schedule. I was supposed to be able to eat an hour ago, so I'm not going to do that again today. So Appreciate you guys watching. Thank you guys for following the series. To be continued, possibly later tonight for a little stream. We'll see. And then also possibly tomorrow evening. I will not be live in the afternoon like I typically am on Sunday because I have to go play poker. But yeah, thank you guys so much. Be on the lookout for some DD2 videos over the next couple weeks. And we shall continue playing. And thanks for sharing your guys' pawns with me. I didn't think it was going to be that fun. That was awesome. That was good fun. All right, um, let me see if anybody on the wolf pack is online right now. Don't see anybody on Twitch right now. That Luality, so I'll send you guys over to Luality stream right now. And she is the one that's um, the pawn that I called in, if you guys want to go watch her for a little bit. And I will catch you guys on the next one. Appreciate it. Go raid Luality and tell her that her pawn was beautiful. <laughs> Ready up. Three, two, one. Hendo. Right. Oh, crap. I didn't have... Why is that so loud? Holy sh... All right, YouTube chat. I'll catch you guys in the flip. Peace out, my friends. Peace out. Thank you guys for everything.